That's not something I will put this game down on is you don't get experience that quickly. We should go somewhere more private. You're on patrol, so make sure you take out those others. Here we go. Not one of them I expected to see. Yeah, they definitely give you the more reason to use clairvoyance. Because those enemies did not show up here for Kasane until later on. Way later on. What phase is this? Five? Where are we going? Oh, just over there. This area should be safe enough to talk. Why didn't we just stay in the safe zone? That the new Himuka government was transforming people into others? Yes, it was a long time ago. But Fabuki's fiance, Alice Ichijo, was also metamorphosed. My brother and Fabuki began investigating the cause of Alice's metamorphosis. The case led them to find out about new Himuka's personality rehabilitation, metamorphosis technology, and the surveillance systems of each city. Excuse me, do you mean my Aunt Alice? That's right, she was your aunt. Have you heard anything? No. I was told she joined OSF and planned to leave when she turned 20, but she was killed in the line of duty. That's why my family was in such strong opposition to me being scouted. But since we're legally unable to refuse... Hey, I found the file on Alice Ichijo in the database. She looks exactly like Hanabi. Alice was the daughter of OSF Hospital's previous chairman. That's why she was engaged to Spring Pharmaceuticals Major General Fubuki. Mm. I think that's true. It's the first I've heard this, but it seems plausible. If this was a plan led by the new Himuka government, does that mean my father knew about it? Oh. Mm. I think he did. Moreover, it might be better to assume that he was at the center of it all. <laughs> and does my brother know about it too? Probably. Am I the only one who was kept in the dark? Yuito, Kasane is coming. Eight o'clock. Uh oh. Kasane, just hold on. We can talk this over. No point. You'll be dead. Oh God, Kasane. Can we not? Oh god. Yeah, you got a Rashi and Kagero with you. Just 
this. Fine. Will you please call down Sugumi? Taking out Arashi. Arashi? Kasane is out of blood. She may kill us if we don't give it our own. Okay. One down. Focus. Got him killed. I won't make the same mistake twice. I'm going to stop Kasane. Shit. Oh yeah, you also have your thing activated. Mine's better. Invisibility doesn't help if I trap you in a corner. Okay. Two down. Kasane. 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 There you are. Give him a Oh, I need to change who my parties are. Who the people fighting next to me are, rather. I should have saved that for when I had some others to fight. Kasane, tell me, why did you kill my father and join Seiron? Didn't kill your father. Is it because my father was involved in metamorphosis research? Because new Himuka turned Naomi into an other? So you found out about it too. Yes, that's exactly right. Hey, Kodama's coming. What? What is she doing here? Master Yuito, Kodama is here. Huh? Ooh. Wait, Kasane. Your distraction. Oh, that traitor Kasane is here too? That's fine. It is a pleasure to meet you, Master Yuito. I'm Kodama Malone. I believe this is our first time meeting as well. Oh, you're right. But I'm only loyal to Master Yuito. What? Ooh. Oh, Master Yuito, I have a message from Master Fubuki. He's taking care of everything, so you can come back now. So, are you on our side, Kodama? Of course. I am always on your side, Master Yuito. Officially, my position may be the leader of Kodama Platoon and Major General Fubuki's aide, but my heart will always belong to you, Master Yuito. You're creepy. Maybe no one trusts you, Wataru. I mean, your sister went to Seiron after all. Shut up. Don't group me in with Haruka. And it wasn't just to deliver a message. I had to give this to you, too. What is it? Your medicine that was discarded at the OSF hospital. Oh. Is that okay? I don't mean to offend my uncle, but isn't it dangerous to take meds from the OSF hospital? Hanabi! And this goes for the rest of you as well. But it's in your best interests not to talk about or criticize the hospital in Suo. I'm sure you know why. Because the government is monitoring everyone. Exactly. Well, I'll be going back now. See you later, Matthew. You didn't criticize the hospital. Let's just brainwipe you. Huh? This ampule. It's the same as the one I found in the abandoned underground subway. Yeah, don't take Why those. Why don't we stop by the hideout before returning to Suo to go over everything we learned? We won't have to worry about anyone listening there. 
And don't worry, recording conversation data through my control system isn't allowed. Now that I think about it, Major General Fubuki probably prohibited recording in order to protect the OSF after he learned the truth about the government. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, don't take those. Don't take those, Yuito. I don't care if they help your brain or not. Don't take them. <laughs> so much has happened. It feels like my brain is fried. Let's go over our situation first. Research on powers is being conducted at the old Ichijo OSF hospital building. Including brain wiping and brain. making people into others. To turn people into others and perform personality rehabilitation. Yes. You can't blame yourself. You didn't know about any of this. Yes, you are so kind to everyone. How to be your family or not you. you Just because they did bad things care. doesn't mean you're at fault. Thank you. Moving on. The government is well aware that we've come to know this information. Major General Fubuki is trying to put out the fires. But it would be best to consider the possibility that we will become fugitives from the government. Anyone on the run from the government won't survive. Wait, there's Seiron. Yes. Worst case scenario, we should consider fleeing to Seiron. And Yuito, how has your memory been? I haven't had any missing gaps in my memory recently. I think. If anything strange happens, please let us know. Although, concerning that medication, you were- Don't take it! It was prescribed by the OSF hospital. It kind of scares me. Yes, I'm concerned as well. Don't take right. it. I think it would probably be best to avoid taking it. Unless your condition significantly worsens. No, I'm not even if your condition worsens. <laughs> I don't trust it. Do you think it would be a good idea to ask my brother about this? Yeah, he's probably yeah, evil. Suragi is your older brother. I would advise against it. The chief is with the government, after all. Of course, he is also your family. But any unnecessary contact would be dangerous right now. I wouldn't want to hinder Major General Fubuki in any way. Yes, you're right. Kaito, were you aware of Nuhimuka's power experiments? Did Dad and Kaito do that to Nagi? Damn it! The only one that was left in the dark was me. Only me. Maybe this is also why they didn't want him joining the OSF. I've been thinking about this too much. My brain is going numb. I should get some rest. Yeah, you should. Considering you've had brain problems for a while now. Yuito, wake up! Watcher is on the line. Sorry, I only meant to take a little break, but it looks like I fell asleep. So, Wataru, what's up? Is the fact that we snuck into the old OSF hospital going to be an issue? No, Major General Fubuki was able to take care of that for us, so that's not a problem anymore. It might not be a big deal, but I thought I should let you know about the hole in Kunat Highway. The hole? Now that you mention it, there was oh, the black hole the thing. above Kunat Highway. I guess you could call it a hole. So much happened after that, I'd forgotten about it. I thought you meant like a pit kind of hole. <laughs> the government is calling it the Kunat Gate. A survey team took a look, but aside from the extremely localized gravitational anomaly, they don't know anything about it. It's just that it has similar characteristics to a black hole, so that area has been deemed off limits. Kunat Gate. Nothing could be seen on the other side. It was unsettling you might not go there but i figured it's better to know about it than not that's true thanks for telling me about it if you learn anything more please let me know as you wish oh i almost forgot yuito platoon's next orders are to stay on standby so you can hang around the hideout a little while longer really then i think we should do just that yes that is a good idea Knowing Fubuki, I'm sure he arranged all of this, so I think it's best to comply. Which 
choice of faces. Eyes are open. Mind if I come in? Major General Fubuki, how did you find this place? I told him. I thought it would be safer to talk here in the hideout rather than meet in the safe zone every time. Yeah, the safe zone probably look like to sneak past their surveillance. Kind of creepy. So we should be fine for a little while. They started monitoring you? I told you before that I was a government dog. But I don't have to be a dog anymore. Now that Karin's gone. What do you mean? Karin's personality didn't make him popular with the government. The top brass has been targeting him for elimination or personality rehabilitation. For Duh, they could but try. Karin took on the role of being the government's puppet, directing the OSF in Karin's place. So, does he... He doesn't know that I had to become his monitor in order to protect him from the government. Basically, Besides, then you also hit. Him, he'd probably just tell me to stay out of it. To be honest, I'm a little relieved. I don't have to be the government's yes man anymore. Government surveillance will be stretched thin after Ceron's uprising. I don't plan on missing this opportunity. I should be able to bring change to this country by taking a different path from Karin. Different path? So the government's bad no matter what side you're on. This country is aggressively pursuing power research through illegal human experimentations. I have no idea why. They can get away with it because the government has complete control over information. Even the media is under the government's monitoring and influence. I want to find out why they would do this and free this country from its corrupt system. Karin joined forces with Ceyron and rebelled against the state to do the same. However, I feel that collapsing the government system from the inside is the fastest way to results. My brother is trying to change this country from the outside, while you're trying to change it from within. Yes. Feigning loyalty allows us opportunities to learn valuable information. We should be able to find out what the government is hiding through the city computer Arahabaki. Please, let me help you. I want to know what my father has done, and what my brother is hiding. Yuito, you are the commander of this platoon, and a commander's number one responsibility is to their platoon members. I'm pretty sure they all want to know too. These government secrets, it will undoubtedly put your platoon members in danger. They've kind of gotten roped into this then in please, many ways. From command. I can't do that because, for better or worse, there are many eyes on you. There's also the fact that your post was specifically ordered by Chief Kaito huh. Suragi. Well, if we all agree with what Commander Yuito is doing, then it doesn't matter. Yama. Either way, my time with the OSF is drawing to an end. I'm getting too old. But before I leave, I want to uncover the truth. I want to know why that happened to Naomi. And why Nagi received personality rehabilitation. I agree with Gemma. If you're going to try to uncover the government's secrets, then I would like to help. I was also subjected to this country's human experiments. What do you mean? My brother Karin and I received power enhancement treatments. I had no idea. If Yuito can't be removed from the platoon, then you can remove the platoon members instead. Any member who doesn't want to take part in this can simply be assigned to a different platoon. Fine. You can't very well turn down your help now. However, reorganizing your platoon requires paperwork. So I will issue you an official deployment order in the meantime. Please gather intel around the Seiron area. I've heard OSF deserters are appearing around Mizuhagawa. Former OSF members sympathetic to Seiron's cause could be up to something. While you're investigating, I will take the steps necessary to reassign Hanabi and Sugumi to a different platoon. What? Oh. Okay, get to it then. I don't think they want to go. <laughs> Stay in the platoon as the operator. What that is in? I'll help you stop the government from doing whatever they want. Thanks, Wataru. Oh wait. Gonna 
let's switch this to I'll do Luca and Hanabi. That's my primary two. There's a chance that Seiron OSF patrols might show up beyond this point. Let's keep our eyes open. Were you serious about what you said back at the hideout? About helping Major General Fubuki? Right. Because wouldn't that mean going against your brother and your late father? I'm... staying in this platoon. What? Sugumi. What happened to Naomi was terrible. And if the government had something to do with it, then I won't let them get away with it. Hold on. Incoming others from the front. Hanabi, Tsugumi, we'll talk later. For now, let's clean up the others. Yeah, you're right. On this side. <laughs> Some minor. Ooh, I like it. It's pretty. Yet. Yuito, are you okay? Uh oh. Yuito lost time again. Huh? Yeah, I didn't take too much damage in that fight. What are you talking about? You suddenly said your head hurt and stopped dead in your tracks. Huh? Did you black out again? Do you remember what we were talking about? Oh god. <laughs> you just almost unreli unreliable narrator because he's blacking out. Sugumi said she was going to stay in the platoon. And after that? After oh, they that, showed we up. Attacked by others. So we obviously didn't talk about anything. <laughs> right? You don't remember Luca and Gemma's stories? What did they talk about? About my aging, and the experiments Luca was subjected to. <sighs> Sorry, I don't remember any of that. Did you really talk about that? Yuito, I was listening, so I can verify. I'm not seeing any abnormalities to your status, so maybe it's just mental exhaustion, like the doctor said. The more you use your power, the more you tax your brain. It might be better to avoid fights right now. I can't do that. We have our assignment. Uh-oh. Are you really okay? Snakebow. Ginger. Huh? What? Flaxpig. Table slug? What? None of the words are matching what I'm thinking. Apple home child. 
Are you having a stroke? What's going on? His speech is impaired. His brain must have experienced a great amount of stress. Well, what can we do? We have the medication the hospital provided. But that ampule seems fishy. It looks exactly like the ampules we found at the abandoned subway. Everyone, be careful. You have an other closing in on you. His timing couldn't be worse. Stay here and rescue me, Toad. We'll handle the others. Damn it! My head feels like it's going to split in two! Uh-oh. 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 Come on. Come on. It's like using the brain thing. Bad idea. But you're gonna do it, aren't you? No time to be squeamish. That other's gonna kill me if I don't take this. I have to. <laughs> Yuito? Did he drink the medication? Sugumi. I'm looking now. Oh, the abnormality in his cranium is starting to disappear. This medication is really working. My head is starting to hurt a lot less. Yuito! Let's go! Can you fight? Yeah, I'm good. <sighs> this is still kind of sketchy, Yuito. feel fine now. I know I had you worried, but I'm glad I took it. Honestly, I wasn't going to be any help in that condition. That makes sense. And I'm not seeing any signs of side effects either. Perhaps there was no need to worry about the medication after all. I still think there's some well, cause for concern. It weird and tasted really bad. Are we going to continue on our assignment? Shouldn't we go back to the hideout and rest a little bit? I'm fine. My powers are working normally again. I'll let you know if something feels off. Let's keep going. Copy that. But please don't push yourself too hard. Promise me. Okay. I promise. Oh. Y'all do know. Okay. <laughs> Here's what I thought I realized it. So from what you ain't done miss, in regards to... I believe Luca was originally a dud. So experiments gave him powers. I'm not sure about Karen. Uh, in terms of Gemma's aging, I know there's the suppression. 
the thing. So Gamma started later, that's why he looks older. Same for Kagero though. Oh, I'm not sure anything else particular? Or I'm not remembering any other particulars? Shit, I wanted to do this. Okay, this is just a side adventure. So there is a trophy for taking out, I can't remember how many in this field. That's why I want to try to use it when I have it. 
Especially when there's a group around. I can't even get any SAS refill. Swing my sword at him. Wait, there's something up ahead. The extinction belt is thick above that area, so I can't attack anything from my end. Any other information? I think they're trucks. Two of them. They're moving towards Ceyron? Hmm? What is it? I thought I just saw something inside the truck bed. Although, it was probably my imagination. Okay, I managed to tap into a nearby surveillance camera feed. Those are OSF transport vehicles. And they're... Enemy or ally? Yuito Platoon is the only OSF team deployed near Mizuhagawa. So they're serious? Seiron's OSF team. I see two individuals heading towards us. It looks like Kagura and Kyoka. Of course, they're invisible. Be careful, I'm not picking them up at all. All right, right. here they come. Right. Take that. Too late. Okay. Kyoka's doubles her. Come on. Focus on her first. Definitely getting more difficult. Oh, we're stronger than anticipated. Let's go. We did what we needed to. Were Kyoka and Kagero guarding this area? Could it have to do with the transport vehicle? They were clearly stalling for time. I'll try to follow them. Sugumi, could you send me their tracking data? I can't. There are so many Kagoros and Kyokas. They're all going in different directions. That's Kyoka's duplication power. They're attempting to confuse us. I'm sorry. It's going to take time to identify the real pair. I also lost sight of the transport vehicles. I hate losing. Mm -hmm. It was a diversion to hide the transport vehicle's destination from Sugumi. Which direction were the vehicles going the last time you saw them? I think towards Seiron. They must have been carrying something important if they made sure we didn't follow. We might be able to find out some key information. Give me some time. I'll see what I can find out with Sugumi's information. Yuito, there's a place I want to check out, but it's in a different direction from Seiron. It looks like the duplicates are all avoiding this area. I can't be sure, but it seems suspicious. Hmm. Nice catch, Wataru. Okay, we'll go check it out. The place they're avoiding might be exactly where I need to go. Oh god, this place. What is this place? There's nobody here. Hey, I see the transport vehicles. Then this must be it. We're pretty far from the city. 
Do you think this is still Seiron's facility? I can't seem to find any information on it at all, which only makes it more suspicious. It looks like they haven't noticed us yet, but I do feel a strange presence here. I can't really put it into words either. I will go check the vehicle. Sugumi, Wataru, please cover me. Hey, Yuito. Are you remembering things okay? What about your speech? Any headaches? I'm okay for now. No need to worry so much. You weren't making sense. It's natural for her to feel worried. Don't push yourself too hard. You've always had health problems, ever since you were little. That's right. You did mention that before. Yeah. I spent most of my early childhood inside a hospital. They finally let me leave when I was around five, and I've been fine ever since. Wait, Luca found something quite alarming. What do you mean? I know what the transport vehicles are carrying. Uh... Human heads. That can't be. The transport vehicle was filled with these. No, I thought I was just seeing things, but they're really... One of the trucks was already empty. Are their brains still I censoring that? I hope that. they are. Two trucks worth of human heads? What in the hell for? Let's try sneaking in a little further. Kasane and her team might be here. Okay. We need to find out why they're doing this anyway. <laughs> 